I'm gonna need Dragon K to slow down with these damn uh, diss tracks, yo. I get it. But at the same time, y'all making it all for a YouTuber that got a life and a 9 to 5. I mean, not saying YouTubers don't have life, but at the same time, I got I got stuff to do today. <laughs> I had to wait all day yesterday because I had 9 to 5 and had to take care of a sick baby. <laughs> and it took me a long day in the midnight to to uh, do the reaction to uh, K dot one, then the final hit that Drake drop one, and then I uh, final K dot drop one. Like Jesus Christ, slow down, you guys. Like or seriously, slow down, Jesus. Anyway, K dot dropped another one. Literally, I don't know around, it seemed like around the same time. I don't know, but he dropped one called Meet the Gram. So they say a lot of folks saying K dot my guy with this one. Who knows? Let's get it. Again, sorry for the those in the background. Um, I'm doing last minute drying. Well, actually, a, a Rick, Rick release on my baby's clothes for our event today. So, anyway. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. Your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you... First of all, you know I hate that had the line journal, but god damn it, yo. Oh Lord. Yeah, he about uh Drake he, he, that's all the first let that's all the first line. Drake about how to he got Drake in this one, right? That's all the first line. Sorry. Gotta grow up and then stand behind them. Life is hard, I know. The challenge is always go beat us home. Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown. And you're a good kid that need good leadership. Let me be your mentor, since your daddy don't teach you shit. Never let a man piss on your leg, son. Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son. Never fall in the escort business, that's bad religion. Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches. Never cold switch, whether right or wrong. You're a black man, even if it don't benefit your goals do some push-ups get some discipline don't cut them corners like your daddy did fuck what ozempic did don't pay to play with them brazilians get a gym membership understand no throwing rocks and hiding hands that's law don't be ashamed about who you with that's how he treats your moms don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again be sure five percent will comprehend but 95 is lost be proud of who you are your strength come from within a lot of superstars that's real but your daddy ain't one of them and you nothing like him you'll carry yourself as king can't understand me right now just play this when you 18. god darn he 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 she's he, he hitting with the love blows of this one he going through the throw this one jesus man he doing the kid he really coming with kindness in this one jesus Dear Sandra, your son got some habits I hope you don't hunt them Especially with all the girls that's hurt inside this climate You a woman so you know how it feels to be in alignment With emotions hoping a man can see you and not be blinded Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator Even you said you to prove who he is is a huge favor I think you should ask for more paper And more paper And more, uh, more paper I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions Psychopath intuition The man that like to play victim You raised a horrible fucking person The nerve of you, Dennis Sandra, sit down. What I'm about to say is heavy. Now listen. <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts. I think niggas like him should die. Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest they life. He hates black women, hypersexualize them with kinks of an info fetish. Grew facial hair because he understood being a beard just fit him better. He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance. And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. I've been in this industry 12 years, I'ma tell y'all one little secret It's some weird shit going on and some of these artists be here to police it They be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender Then leak videos, sell themselves to further push their agendas To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're playing your sister Or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones Cat Williams said give you the truth, so I'ma get mine The embassy about to get raided too, it's only a matter of time I says plenty of times, see we just started Cat Williams, god damn it! Hey, Lil Bron, keep the family away. Hey, Curry, keep the family away. To anybody that embody the love for their kids, keep the family away. They looking at you too, if you standing by him. Keep the family away. I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives. Keep the family safe. She just started Cat Williams. Lord. Dear baby girl, I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world. He don't commit. 
expose a baby girl. Oh, shit. Too much, but it's music, yeah, that's for sure. Be a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families, oh, right? Taking care of that. his own. Should be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you. Or at your 11th birthday, singing poems with you. Instead, he being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks. Examples that you don't deserve. I want to tell you that you're loved. You're brave. You're kind. You got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind. Because our children is the future, but he lives inside confusion. Money's always been illusion but that's the life he's used to his father probably didn't claim him neither history do repeats itself sometimes it don't need a reason but i would like to say it's not your fault that he's hiding another child give him grace this the reason i made mr morale so our babies like you can cope later give you some confidence to go through something it's hope later i never want to hear you chasing man because it's felt behavior sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation you need to know that love is eternity and trumps all pain I tell you who your father is Just play this song when it rains Yes, he's a hit maker, songwriter, superstar, right? And the fucking dead beat that should never say more life Meet the grams Lord. We ain't done Oh, Lord, now what? Dear Harbury oh, I know you probably man. thinking I wanted to crash your party but truthfully, I don't have a hating bone in my body. It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game. But you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like to understand, cause your house was never a home. 37, but you showing up as a seven year old. You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems. Bad with money, horror house, soliciting women problems. Therapies are lovely start but i suggest some ayahuasca strip the ego from the bottom i try to empathize with you because i know that you ain't been through nothing crave entitlement but want to be like so bad that it's puzzling no dominance let's recap moments when you didn't fit in no secret handshakes with your friend no culture cachet to binge just disrespecting your mother identities on the fence don't know which family would love you the skin that you living in is compromised and personas can't channel your masculine even when standing next to a woman you a body shamer you go hide them baby mamas ain't you you embarrassed of them that's not right that ain't how mama raised us take that mask off i want to see what's under them achievements why well, believe you you never gave us nothing to believe in because you lied about religious views you lied about your surgery you lied about your accent and your past tense all is perjury you lied about your ghost riders you lied about your crew members they all pussy you lied on them i know they all got you in them you lied about your son you lied about your daughter huh you lied about them other kids that's out there hoping that you come you lied about the only artist that can offer you some help Fuck a rap battle. This a long life battle with yourself. Drake went there, but I don't know. He must have heard that already. Oh, long the wind came. Huh. Woo. Yeah, K Don let me speak from that one. Jesus. Oh, I know the Drake painters going to have a fill day. Because they already had filled day with the last one. They really have a fill day now. Jesus. Oh, man. Let's hope we don't get too far. I'm ready for it to already see see response to these, man. Cause Jesus, and also can we see uh, in the clutch for reaction to these? Cause my by God Almighty, that's all I want to say about that. In the words of Jim Ross, or the words of Rod Simmons. Damn. Woo. Anyway, both I will say both was hitting dodges. I think K and I hit a little harder. Anyway. Let me know what y'all think. If you like my reaction, like, share, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's your boy T-Bear signing off. Well, uh, 